Hello everyone. Today we are going to balance this equation. Okay, this is potassium hydroxide, this is copper sulfate, this is copper hydroxide and this is potassium sulfate. Okay, to balance the reaction, uh, I have to draw a table like this. Okay, let me change the uh, color. I hope it will be helpful. Uh, on the left hand side or reactant right side, we have here one potassium, right? So let me write that. And here we have one uh, hydroxide ion, which is polyatomic ion, you know. And this is, uh, we have here one uh, copper, and here we have one sulfate, right? So let me write that. And on the right hand side, we have here uh, one copper, so I have to write here. And here we have one hydroxide, two hydroxide ion, so I have to write here. Right. And here we have two potassium, so let me write here this. And here we have one sulfate. And sulfate okay to balance this uh, equation what can I do uh, here I see that uh, one potassium but here two potassium so uh, now I can multiply here by two that gives me two right okay and if I multiply here by two these two must come before this potassium now I have to search for potassium in the equation so I have to place here coefficient two right if I place here coefficient 2, the number of potassium will be 2. Uh, already we have 2 potassium here. And here we are getting 2 of uh, two hydroxide. So I have to change my number of hydroxide on the left side. So here we are getting 2 hydroxide. Okay. So our potassium is balanced. Our hydroxide 2, 2 is balanced. Copper 1, 1 is balanced. And sulfate 1, 1 is balanced. So you can... Uh, say that this is the balanced equation. Okay, let me show you the second way to balance this equation. I think it, it, it will be very helpful for you uh, in your exam hall. So, <clears throat> let me do it. Okay. You know that you can write potassium like this. Potassium hydroxide copper sulfate and what will this positive will go with this negative that is you are getting here positive potassium sulfate right so here you have 2 minus 1 plus so balance the charts you have to add here 2 if you add here 2 these 2 potassium must come from this compound so you have to place here 2 okay this positive will go with this negative that is uh, copper 2 plus and hydroxide 1 minus to balance the uh, positive and negative you can place here 2 so you are getting here 2 hydroxide and here you have 2 hydroxide so this is the balanced balanced equation thank you for viewing this video be well